Screencasting. What is a screencast? Very simply, a screencast is a video of your computer screen with the intent of delivering information or demonstrating a skill or task. In education, most screencasts will also contain a recording of the teacher's voice and oftentimes a thumbnail view of the teacher as well. This particular screencast is for the purpose of delivering information. The next one I have prepared for you is for the purpose of demonstrating a task. Five uses of screencasting. In his article titled Top Five Uses of Screencasting in the Classroom, Ron Kotlick outlines the most common and best ways to utilize screencasting to enhance and restructure the way certain information is delivered to students. First way is live screencasting. There is also online hybrid or blended learning screencasting. Student created content. Professional development. And screencasting and grading. Live screencasting is a live recording during a class lesson or activity and is one of the easiest ways to begin. The flipped classroom or the idea of presenting content material through a video that frees class time for more engaging activities and instruction is extremely appealing. Many teachers feel that they lack the time to invest in making videos of history lectures, math lessons, or chemistry overviews to make this dramatic change in their content delivery. An easy way to overcome this hurdle is to make live screencasts of in-class content delivery and then transform those screencasts into videos for students to use as a review for this year and then for a flipped classroom the following year. As the year progresses, the teacher's video repertoire grows without taking too much additional time to create. The idea of creating live screencasts during class was born out of necessity when a student was absent for an extended time from a medical issue. Recordings of all class content lectures were recorded and uploaded for the student to view at home. In addition to aiding absent students, creating live screencasts can be made for directions of daily assignments and complex projects. Imagine how much time is spent retelling students directions that were given in class. Online Hybrid Blended Learning Screencasting can be used for any grade level that involves any aspect of online delivery. The growth of online instruction has been tremendous and proponents of this trend like offering instructional content and interaction anywhere, anytime, and any place. Teachers can make engaging screencasts of any aspect of instruction, including content delivery, direct instruction, reading analysis, math problem solving, etc. These personal videos made by the instructor gives the online student a direct connection with an individual that goes beyond posting on a discussion board or an email thread. Student created content. In middle school, most of the screencasting is probably going to be done by teachers. However, there is a tremendous possibility in the idea of students creating screencasts. Students can create screencasts for assignments and course content. Here, the possibilities are endless. Students can easily screencast traditional slide presentations and add more dynamic elements for visually appealing videos. Students can also create compelling digital stories for history and English classes that are engaging and showcase their creativity. Some flipped classroom practitioners teach their students screencasting so their students can be become the creators of video content. This is an exciting twist on the flip model which puts more focus on student-based performance assessments rather than teacher-centered videos. This practice truly epitomizes the essence of inquiry-based instruction and student-centered learning. Regardless of the method of instruction, the course curriculum, or the specific learning activity. Student-created screencasts motivate students to take control of the learning process. Professional development. Professional development is crucial for the proper implementation of technology integration. However, there is often not enough time for these activities during the school year, and all too often new technologies are quickly introduced to teachers and administrators without the proper support or opportunities for them to grasp the technology 
and feel confident enough to actually use it. Screencasting is a wonderful tool that can capture professional development sessions and make them available for online consumption. Online professional development offers educators the flexibility to learn new practices at an acceptable pace. Screencasting and grading. Educators are always striving to find better and more efficient ways to offer constructive feedback on student assignments. Depending on a particular class size or student-teacher ratio, one-on-one -on -one tutoring sessions between a student and teacher are often impossible to schedule. Screencasting can be the perfect tool to quickly create meaningful comments on an assessment or an assignment that go beyond text and rubric scores. Students can literally watch a screencast of an assignment being graded with the teacher or professor giving audio and visual cues. This creates a virtual conference between the teacher and student and allows the student to get a better understanding of the grading process. Teachers or professors can archive those screencasts to demonstrate a student's growth throughout a particular course, and students can also reference the screencast to avoid similar pitfalls in later assignments. What is realistic? Obviously, for our purposes, the most realistic and most beneficial way to use screencasting is going to be to deliver content or skills through a video medium. The purpose of the screencast may vary from flipping a classroom, students who are absent and need to make up work, reteaching students who are not grasping the concept, and or enrichment for students ready to move forward.